I usually have the parents bring in t favorite toys and some snacks. So we stop as many times, whether it's just to play and time to take a time out, or you need to um, you know, eat, or they need to be changed, whatever it is. My sessions are very laid back, so. Are you better now? You just wanted mommy to hold you. I've taken a few courses with Anna Brandt, who is world-renowned newborn and maternity photographer. My passion really is for maternity, births, newborns, and you know, first one-year-old, two-year-olds, toddlers. Those, those, that's my love. That's my absolute passion. I do high school seniors. They're always a fun group because they all come with their unique personalities. One of the things I love about photography is that I showcase everyone's personality. I don't just want to just, you know, snap a shot, okay, you know, you can do that with your iPhone. I want to bring out those personalities. Yes, I do, you know, post shots, but I also do a lot of lifestyle shots. I do also those in-between moments when they're, when people's real personalities come through, when they're laughing, when they're giving that look that is their look. You know, I think everybody has a certain look, you know, a certain um, face they make, you know, whether it's cocking an eyebrow up or, you know, the way they, you know, purse their lips or something that just, oh, that's so-and-so's look, that defines them, but yet in a regular picture, they're not going to show that. They're just going to be, you know, they're going to do the smile that they think they have to do. So I kind of get all of that in, in my photography. And to me, that's what makes it worthwhile. I, I love doing the photo shoots and I love editing them. I love going because there's usually not too much editing that's needed. You know, you get everything right in camera first. But just putting those finishing touches on or sometimes just doing a, something a little artistic or different and then... Um, when I show the clients their photos and they see them for the very first time and I mean I've had people you know just their jaw drops but I've had people even just cry and say oh my gosh we look so beautiful or I look so beautiful I never thought you know wow you know just it just is is heartwarming and my style is kind of hard I, I because it is a mixture of posing and lifestyle um, I tend to do more clean edits. I do some artistic here and there, but the majority of what I do, I try to just keep it clean. So, you know, the focus is on the client, you know? I mean, I definitely, obviously I have backgrounds and things like that, um, but, you know, some people do really, you know, heavily artistic photos, which I do once in a while, but I always want to make sure within the shoot, though I may give them some artistic ones, that they also have just a nice clean Clean edit. And that usually works for me too. And then if I have a question, those ones I've done some square ones. So those photos so that you can, if you want to do some of my square 16 by 16 configurations, you can do that. Mm -hmm. okay. I love this one of her playing with her pearls. Yes. Yeah. Oh, she loved those pearls. She is yeah. a girly girl. She is. Oh, yeah. Silver white linens that fade into spring Flowers and whispers and beautiful things And it seems that God made you just for me Some call it destiny, some call it fate A reason, a season, a lifetime to wait I believe that God made you just for me and poses were just like an exodus led here by Moses and sometimes it feels like the prophets had told us to be 